Alright, so I'm gonna be Deadly Club Step today. Unless I get really unlucky and keep dying to the end, which is very possible because of how hard the ending is for this level. But, um, yeah, so, um, I just did a lot of practice on it. I have quite a bit of practice on it already. Um, yeah, I have about 400 attempts or so on it. Um, so yeah. Um, I got 58 on it last night, and I stopped there because I, it was really late. But yeah, I'm gonna just go ahead and start again today. I got some good runs on it today, so I'm hoping this shouldn't take too long, but you never know. Yeah, and this level is really hard to learn because it's a memory level, but, well, there's quite a bit of memory in it, but like... That I keep failing at pretty miserably. I mean, I didn't practice that part at all today. So it'll be a little bit for me to figure it out. But, yeah. Once I get past that memory part for the first time, I will start getting past it more frequently. It's just me kind of... Once I do it once, I'll be able to do it multiple times. Don't forget about that. Yep. Although the, the ship part does get consistent, I've noticed, once I kind of figured it out. But this level is... R the hardest parts in this are just like a couple random choke points in like one of the ball parts, and the memory cubes, and then just the ship parts. Those are the hard parts of this. Which add up to make it actually really quite a bit tougher than some of the hard demons I've been beating recently, like... Well, no, not Fairy Dust. It's I think this is easier than Fairy Dust, but like it's harder than Nine Circles. Oh, I just got a lag spike for some reason. <sighs> that spike really does not need to be there. In it. Yeah, see, like I was struggling with that memory part, but as soon as I did it once, I'm able to replicate it several times. Oh yeah, <laughs> that was just me being dumb. That was just a big dumb. Oh yeah, there's one UFO part right at the very end of this level that kind of sucks. Oh yeah, forgot about that. Cannot forget about that yellow orb. It comes up way sooner than you think. Or I could just fluke it, honestly. Although no, I probably won't because the last ball is really hard. In the That's a really awkward part to enter, but dang, that was a really good fluke. That was... Oh my gosh, you got past so many hard parts. Yeah, I actually... Um, I am finding this level fun, but that's honestly probably because of the fact that it's... Quite a ways away for my like skill level and so I'm able to kind of you know just play it for fun kind of casually and just do well in general which is nice but if like I was doing this for a new hardest I probably would not enjoy this at all that's kind of what I've noticed is like unless you really really like the level it's hard to really enjoy a new hardest Although, I mean, I enjoyed Chroma quite a bit, and Ultra Chromatic was also pretty good, but I got... I didn't get frustrated at all with Chroma. And then Ultra Chromatic is, was probably better than Chroma, in my opinion, but I got a lot of more frustrated with Ultra Chromatic. Oh my 
god, what the hell? Why do you... Oh my god, are you kidding me? That UFO is also bullshit because if you enter it in an incorrect way, you just die. Even though I have a consistent, consistent click pattern, that apparently didn't work that time. whoop de doo Hopefully my suffering will mean I can fluke the ending. But with my track record, probably not. Although, actually no. My track record is fluking things sometimes. What I, so the, my, my, my biggest problem with ball timings like that is that the way the ball moves is it's so unsatisfying because like it's both really slug it's like really sluggish to move so like you have to click way earlier than you think and then like it probably looks like you have to but like it's really not even that sluggish but it's like just sluggish enough yeah and that makes timings like that really obnoxious Oh yay, lag spike. My favorite. <sighs> Should have already beaten this, but no. No, I'm stuck here now. Oh my god, are you kidding me? How was that too early? Oh yeah, and what I really love about UFO parts like that with the spikes is like dying to the edge of the spike. It's like you just graze the edge of the spike because the angle you go up at and it's just, oh my god, it annoys me every single time. Every single time. One reason why I really dislike the temple levels because that's mainly what you died to in the UFO parts was the side of the spikes. And I'm telling you, it was consistent. And great, now I can't even get past the easy timings at the beginning. Oh! That ball is so dumb because it requires you to like start it early, but nope, don't start it too early because there's extra spikes there. Why? I don't know. Because it's funny. Alright, I'm done for today. Screw this. Terrible. Hate it. Yeah, no, the problem with this level is it's just choke point central, honestly. There, and the problem with choke points is, like, sure, they're, like, it's only a few points, but it's just highly inconsistent, and you're just going to continuously die to it. It just really annoys you after a while if you get unlucky with them. But if you get lucky with these kinds of levels, they are fun. By the way, I'll probably cut till tomorrow.
GG. I knew I just needed to come back after resting for at least one day. Although it's been a couple of, several days since I've beaten this. <sighs> Alright, well, I'll go ahead and add up the attempts. So, I would say this level is reasonably fun. Um, there, there are a couple problems, though. It's, it's like, um, there's too many choke points in it. It's like, although I think the only choke point that I actually found fun was probably the, um, it was the, what was it again? Oh, um, the choke point that I found fun was the ship. Yeah, it was the ship. Um, that one part was actually kind of fun, but like, this ball right here, it's terrible because of this stupid click. Which I'm probably going to, if I do in the video, I'll probably cut to me dying to that a lot. And then this UFO just isn't particularly fun, but it's not hard. And then this UFO is annoying. Yeah. This part right here is pretty good, actually. I quite like this one. But this, this is, oh god, this is terrible right here. I hate it. I hate it so much. It's so bad. It does get consistent, I guess, but it's just like, you have to click so early for the second one. Yeah, no, I, I, I do like this level, though. It's just the choke, kind of dying. I mean, last time I played this, I kept dying to, um, like, yeah, 50, yeah, that one click I keep saying is really annoying. And it just killed my enjoyment, just tanked it completely. But... In the end, it's not terrible, but it's not amazing. So yeah, I mean, that's about all I have to say on it. I'm Aofi Pulser, and I just beat Deadly Clubstep.